Hi, in this video we're going to talk about mission types. Mission Manager is used for everything from lost persons, natural disasters, law enforcement activities, fire, even picnics and parades. You can accommodate these different types of missions or activities with the mission type. I've already opened up our John Doe sample mission and I want to point out the mission type in the upper right of the screen. If we press the little down arrow button next to the mission type, we get a list of different types we can choose from. Your list of types might be different from the ones shown here. The default types of missions are populated by the team type that you selected when you created your mission manager account. You can change and add new mission types in the configuration screen. I'm going to show you where to do that in just a minute. First I want to show you what these different mission types do to these screens. Currently is set at lost person. Because we're set at lost person, we have a subjects tab. Obviously, we need to enter in the information about the subject that we're looking for. Also, the mission checklist is based on what the things we should do for a lost person. If we were to go up and we would change the mission type to say a severe weather type mission, you can see that we get fewer tabs at the top. We no longer have the subjects tab. You can also see that the mission checklists have changed. Let's leave this mission and jump over the configuration so you can see how you can change and add new mission types. We'll press the leave mission button, go to the configuration, open the mission type section, and over to the left you see the same list of mission types that we saw in the drop down on the general screen. I can select any of these mission types, say a downed aircraft, and then I can customize what screens will be available for this type of mission, my mission checklist, my ICS positions, and several other things that are very specific to this type of event. You can also add new mission types by pressing the Add Type button. You're presented with a dialog of several mission types that Mission Manager has built in. You can select one that's similar to the type that you want to create and use it as your template to adjust your settings after that. That's about it for this video. Look at the help for more information about creating mission types and thanks for watching.